Here's a look at the Harvard starting five. Katie Benzin, Jeannie Bame, Madeline Raster, Jaden Book. Anybody in all of collegiate sports who embodies that better than Enrique Agumbawale. Absolutely, there's the Agumbawale underneath. <laughs> Another miss from Sydney Skinner there. As Agumbawale looks to drive to the basket, she kicks out. It's Young from three. She's got Lewis Academy from New York City. Agumbawale underneath the Shepherd. Again looking for Raster, but it's taken away by Jordan Nixon. Agumba Wale transition once again, off the glass and in. Caitlin Gilbert here on the floor, number 10 for Notre Dame. Her first game with the Irish. Bounce pass underneath, Turner no good, rebounded Shepard, back up and in. Goes in there for a little bit though. We'll have to see if that plays any role as we hit the final moments of this first quarter. Shepard underneath, receives some pressure and some in the national championship. 800th win at Notre Dame. At Notre Dame, that is. Yeah. That's right. Yeah, 888 total in her career. Does doesn't get much better in terms of your eight. For the Fighting Irish in the early going. Turner underneath. Nice find from Shepard. This time the layup won't go either. No, Harvard not getting a bad couple looks here. Just some, some things not bouncing. The defense and transition packages for Notre Dame at <laughs> halftime, Austin. And a Goomba Wale transition one more time. Wow. The bucket and the foul. Position one more time, Turner. Up, oh, she's blocked. what a block. Unbelievable block by Skinner there. Agumbo Wale says, well, I'll take a bounce. So Notre Dame will keep possession. There's a look at the head coach for the Harvard Crimson, Kathy Delaney Smith, in her 37th season at the helm of the team. WNIT in the first round. Driving to the basket is Jackie Young. Second try is good. That is five points now. Step back from Agumba Wale. She's got it. Final 10 seconds of the half. Young plays it inside. A Turner contact. No call, but she gets the basket anyways. A turnover. Shepard. And the buzzer beater to end the half. To get things going in the third quarter. There's Shepard. Get those shots. Get the mismatches inside where they can get them. Another turnover from Harvard. Agumba Wale in transition. Puts it up with the right hand. Undetermined amount of time. Well, that's right there. She is getting the rebound. Couldn't put it back up and in. Brianna Turner a couple tries. Now Shepard gets it back. And that's on, a on the offensive glass. Yeah, we looked at it at halftime in the stats. Those rebounds stuck out. Not much change in here. Notre Dame just has a height advantage. And more transition baskets for the Irish. Blocked underneath by Turner. Irish transition. One more time. Agumba Wale laying it out. It'll be a foul on somebody with that much contact. The question is, who is it? And I agree with you on the tie goes the runner. The out. Trainer. Notre Dame takes it up court for the Irish. I beg your pardon, that's, that's Nixon. The Irish doubling up the Crimson. A jumper from Agumba, 16 called on the Harvard Crimson. Agumba Wale, another jump shot, it's good. Down, uh, here in the second half, so Notre Dame getting a number of blocks from Turner. I'd, I'd have to imagine it's a little more than one as well. Played underneath the basket, it's up. But on the flip side, backside, great offense there by Harvard. Way to go up strong. Get the foul. It's exactly what they need. Yeah, nicely done by Bush. Those are her first three points. And Redford across half court for the Irish. I beg your pardon, that's Nixon. Plays it underneath. Player overall, it's made her mentally stronger, you know, and she expects her to be able to rotate between that point guard and that wing position pretty seamlessly this year. Not happy with from this game. She's not going to be happy about the turnover. She's definitely going to talk to the team about that. And, and to me, that's what makes her one of the best coaches in the nation. And it's why people like Brad Stevens. Noon Shepard, 12 for 16. Let's well, speak of Shepard and Jackie absolutely. Young. Shepard with the Well, she's kept Harvard to under 50 points. Still five minutes to go. In that AP poll, unanimous number one. Louisville. Even though Louisville, they had some struggles last year against Louisville. They feel that this no. See if they can generate anything here offensively with a much, much younger lineup. You just can't stress it enough how valuable these minutes are for these players. Nice extra pass in there. 
Playing it underneath, Vaughn. One more time, she's got it again. Playing that ball underneath in the basket for Caitlin Gil. Ash hits the free throw and the score is corrected on the scoreboard. 103-56, that will do it as the Fighting Irish win in decisive fashion over the Harvard Crimson.